deer damage to corn. Knee high by the 4th of July. How about graze down to mid calf height? They will come and pull out the tassel even very early in the growth phase of corn. And uh, I don't know. It's all going to, I don't think it's going to produce. But we'll, we've got a spray. We've got weed control. we got fertilizer. We just gave it some nitrogen. We'll see what happens. If we get enough tassels, we may get some ears. They'll be smaller sized as the rain comes in. Heavy deer pressure. Short of fencing, I've done everything possible to get this a, to be a good crop. Tilled well, planted well, good germination. Problem is, a good problem, on one hand, we have lots of deer. The bad problem, almost every one of them's topped. The only way you can beat the deer without a fence here is plant way too much. Probably more than five acres. Or get very timely rains. If you get timely rains, you can push it, but we've been dry for three and a half weeks. And the corn's just been sitting here waiting for the rain. So now we got a little bit of rain on the ground, got some nitrogen on the ground. Maybe it can get up past where the deer want to chew on it. Then it'll be them wanting to eat the ears off.